Hi, we're Agents Washington and Carolina from the popular web series Red vs. Blue. And today we'll be talking to you about what to expect when you're asked to do the unthinkable. Return to work. Let's just say you haven't done your job for a while due to some kind of unprecedented event and are now returning to the workplace after complete isolation from your peers. Hypothetically, of course. For many, returning to the office means no more lounging around in your underwear all day. Oh, man. So it's time to bust out those non-pajama pants you've been hoping to throw away. Uh, lame! And wake up while the clock is still in single digits. Ugh, it's way too early for all this yelling. It's a lot to ask, I know. Once you're officially at work comes the real hard part. Remembering how to exist in society again. Oh, hey! Griffin Simmons! How are you guys? Well, I'm back at dumb work, so what do you think? Damn it, why didn't I come up with a cool line like that? I just can't say good or whatever now. The stakes are too hot. Maybe I just don't say anything? Or is that weird? Wait, has it been too long to answer now? Oh god, oh god, oh god! When a newly found social phobia leads to an anxiety attack, remember that it will pass. Try to breathe and resist the urge to give up and run away screaming. Ah! Oh, dude, seriously, enough yelling! Well, I, for one, am happy to be back. We had to leave right when I was taking that winemaking course, and I left a fine rosé fermenting in the base. It's got to be done by now. Was that in the back of the snack closet? Because I ate all that a while ago. Aw, oh, heck. Hey, boy, am I glad to see you guys. You are? Why? Well, isolation hasn't exactly been the most... Isolating. Is that passive-aggressive code for, I'm a terrible roommate? Now, O'Malley, we don't need to air our dirty laundry in front of- Oh! Now you're concerned about the laundry. Need I remind you that I'm a first responder? I've been very busy. It might be around now that you're seeing a lot of your coworkers for the first time since being back. And may notice that they look, sound, or smell a bit different than you remember. Remember Tom in IT? He has a mullet now. Stacy, who runs payroll, also a mullet. Kevin, from down the hall, he's actually had a remarkable fitness journey. He also grew a mullet. Hello. Oh, Caboose. Doc, sister, light red guy whose name I've forgotten now it's too late to ask. Caboose, is that you? You seem, uh, different. Yeah, it's probably my new mullet. Oh. Y'all are a lot weirder than I remember. Now that the day's officially begun, it's time to start diving into the day's tasks. <laughs> Simmons, what are you doing whimpering in the corner? It's not the end of the work week yet. I, I, uh, sorry, sir. I'm just not used to this anymore. <laughs> Good God, the blues are back. Our defenses have been down for months. We got to get a move on before they get the jump on us. It's important to set realistic goals as you fall into a new routine. Don't be afraid of breaking tasks into smaller bits. Instead of reorganizing the entire armory in order from most to least war criminal, uh, you could start with something small, like cleaning your desk? We need to reload the sentries, get marbles and paint cans in all the entryways, refill the snack closet. There's so much to do. No. No, no, no. Hey, hey, Lopez. Que están haciendo idiotas de vuelta? Uh, Griff, what's he saying? He's saying it's lunchtime. Everybody break for lunch. Segue todas las aberturas en la roca con cemento líquido como en traste. Yeah, we get it, Lopez. Union rules. We better hurry, though. I'm getting the stomach grumblies, and I already ate all of Blue Base's snacks while we were waiting. Dude, what the hell? If it makes you feel any better, I don't even have a base to steal food from. That's because you don't have a side. Our side is evil! We deserve a lair equidistant from both red and blue base. Also with an in-ground pool and a grand piano that I refuse to learn to play. Uh, I'd be fine with just the bottom bunk on either side, thanks. The biggest takeaway as we navigate this return to normalcy is that we're all in this together. Ah! Get off my damn lawn, you blue kids! Screw this, I'm going back to bed. Get out of here! Six feet, remember? Where else am I supposed to go? There's plenty of room in my hidey hole. Oh, I remember you now. You're a bagel. La próxima vez necesitamos una blaga de la que los cascos no protegen. That's right. We're all in this together. Except for us, of course. 
who opted to keep working from home because it's better in almost every conceivable way. They can take my pajama pants when they rip them from my cold, dead hands. Thank you for watching this episode of Red vs. Blue. If you want to check out more, go to Rooster Teeth. It's an app, it's a website, it's a lot of stuff.